What's up guys? It's iWarcraft here. Um, I'm currently on my way to class this morning. Uh, it's a nice day out. I'm going skiing right after class, so I'm super excited about that. But today I have a pretty, I'm not going to say it's the most important video I've ever made, but it, it's pretty important. Uh, I just want to let you guys know what is going to be going on in the future. And if you read the title of the video, you know what's going to be going on. And uh, I just want to say I'm super excited about it, guys. I am going to be returning to the world of Warcraft. And there's a few reasons for it. There's a few reasons for it. There's actually a lot of reasons for it. First of all, I just miss the game. Uh, it seems like I'll take a year break from the game, and then I'll, I'll just get to the point where I need to play it again. And that's where I'm at right now. Uh, I, I haven't played any of the Miss of Pandaria content. I'm not going to say any because I got a hunter up to 86. So I played the first level of Mist of Pandaria content on one character and that was it. Um, and I did play a monk for a while. So and that's about all I got done in Mist of Pandaria. And now there's a brand new expansion out. Well, it's not brand new, but it's new in Warlords of Draenor. And I just feel I have missed out on a lot. And I'm not like super disappointed in missing out on all that because what it means for me right now is I get to go back to a game with, with new content, with new stuff to do. And for a while there, World of Warcraft got to the point where there wasn't anything new to do. And that kind of sucked and that's why I ended up leaving the game because they're just, it, it got old, it got boring and uh, you know, there wasn't anything new to do, and uh, it was just a grind. But now, with Warlords of Draenor and Mists, two expansions I haven't explored yet, there's a lot of new things to do. There's a lot of new battlegrounds. There's the Colosseum. Let me backtrack a little bit and tell you exactly what made me want to return for the game. Obviously, all the stuff I just said, but when I when I got back on to War I Warcraft, when I got the channel back, when I got it unbanned, I started watching all my old videos and I remembered how amazing that game truly was and how I kind of forgot about that. I forgot about how amazing World of Warcraft is as a game, how impressive it is as a game. And I started watching all my old videos, I started watching how in love I was with that game and honestly guys, I missed that feeling. I missed loving. World of Warcraft and sharing everything I loved with a YouTube channel. I missed it. And then I kept watching and watching and watching and getting more and more recent. And I kind of saw a decline, the love of the game decline. And then I quit. And then I saw other videos. And now I want to go back to loving that game. You know, I want to go back to sharing everything new with you guys and, and making a YouTube channel around it. And and just doing my thing in World of Warcraft. I want to go back to it because the game itself has changed a lot, like I said. And I feel like if I go back to it now, I've been away for, from it for long enough that I'll, I'll fall in love with the game again. And then, and then not to mention, I started watching old Swifty videos and other World of Warcraft videos on YouTube. And I started watching Coliseum videos and the Coliseum looks so fun that was like once i saw that i'm like wow warlords of draenor looks freaking epic it looks epic let's get back in that baby so that sounded weird but sorry so yeah i will be returning to world of warcraft i don't know what the timetable is going to be currently i have playtime in star wars the old republic and i'm not going to waste that but i don't think i'm going to stay in that game long term who knows, maybe if WoW completely falls through, I might return to Star Wars The Old Republic, but right now I don't think I'm going to be staying at the game long term. Um, I know you get a free level 90 with a purchase of Warlords of Draenor, so I'm going to have to figure figure out what class I'm going to boost to 90. Right now I'm thinking a warrior, but I'm not 100% positive where I'm going to go with that. Um, I'm also thinking Rat Paladin maybe even a mage. So um, right now I have a hunter and rogue, which are my two favorite classes, pretty high up. They're both 80s, um, so I don't need to boost any of them. But uh, maybe a warrior. I think warrior seems like a pretty fun class. Let me know what you guys think about the boost, what I should do with it. 
And uh, yeah, I just wanted to make this video to let you know that yes, in the future, in the near future, within this month, I will be back on World of Warcraft. And uh, I'm super excited about it. So thanks for watching guys. It was a little audio, uh, auto audio vlog, automotive audio vlog today. And I might do more of these because it's really easy and I go to class every day and I'm bored when I go to class. So maybe I'll talk to you guys. So thanks for watching guys. Uh, I will see you in the next video. If you enjoyed or if you're excited for my return to World of Warcraft, hit that subscribe button and we'll have some fun times in the future. All right, guys, I will see you in the next video. Peace.